Hi, it's Christy, and I'm here with an Operation Christmas Child box, this time for a boy, two to four. First of all, you'll notice this great big rubber band. If you're interested in getting those, they're on Amazon. They're number 107. If you go to our website, blessinginashoebox.com, Michelle has a lot of these items um, with a link on them in our bargains and finds section so that you can go right to them but these are amazing and just takes one rubber band to hold the box shut i want to tell you that i had this shoe box all packed and then i closed the lid and it closed real easily and i knew it wasn't full enough <laughs> so i added a few more things so let me show you what's in the box this is remember for a toddler boy I'll start out and show you the Beanie Baby, this inchworm, so cute for a boy. And I base really the colors on the box from the inchworm. So we have, um, I gave him a spiral notebook. I got a lot of them this year. And I know if he's a five-year-old, he might be able to use it next year and save it, or he might have a sibling that can use it. This is a sketchbook just empty pages for him to color on and here is his pencil pouch with um, uh, four pencils a paintbrush and a multi pen and another click pen that has a, a globe on it multi-pen uh, those are at your checkout at your Dollar Tree at least for, for me and this is what the paintbrush is for I got one of these paint with water sets they're every mother's dream <laughs> it's with the, the ability to paint and have a lot of colors but not the mess so I got that at Dollar Tree and I just think that would be the perfect thing for a toddler I hope they can figure out what, how to use the water with that. Here's an orange bandana. It's one of those tubular kind. Um, some action figure dinosaurs. I also got, since it, we have the inchworm theme going on, I got a couple of similar sized bugs. And I thought I had those from a different um, set left over. And I thought, wouldn't that be fun for the insects and the dinosaurs to have a battle? So I'm sending that with a box. Here's his toothbrush. I decided to put in some extra um, color pencils. I wanted him to have the jumbo crayons, but these colored pencils are little and they fit in the box nice and I thought he might be able to use them. So these are, this is a glue stick, all the art supplies that a toddler would ever need. This cute little truck, these I'm using a lot for toddlers, they're easy to grab onto and I find them at Walmart in a, a tube there in the toddler toy section. Here's his, this is a dinosaur material and it has a chalkboard inside. This is chalkboard contact paper. Michelle makes these. And there's an, this pocket has the eraser and the chalk in it. So he'll be able to have fun coloring or drawing, practicing his letters, his numbers on the chalkboard. Here's a comb. Comb and scissors and cute little flip flops from Old Navy. These are 99 cents right now at the Gap Outlet and Old Navy. They're good quality. If you buy the Gap or Old Navy, I really think they're good quality and lasting. Oh, here is this cute little sippy cup. I found these at Target, but Michelle also found for the same price, you can buy them on Amazon with Prime. So these are great for shoe boxes. The, I noticed earlier today that the lids have the same color um, matching seal on them because you can get four different colors come in a pack so you know which um, lid goes on which cup 
and I just have a little hole here and a heart on the lid and inside I have a washcloth and these are my new favorite balls for toddler um, the link for this set of balls which comes in for a hundred for $13.99 on Amazon. That's also on blessingsinissuebox.com. She has the link there. And then when they finish up their drink, there's a heart in the bottom of the cup. So this is a really fun uh, and small to fit in a shoebox uh, cup for a toddler. I'm really thrilled that I found it. I got mine, I ordered it on target.com and then I went in a couple hours later and just picked it up at the customer service it was so convenient but they didn't have every color so if you order it on amazon there's four different colors there's pink purple blue and lime green so that was a good that's a good deal i wanted to pass it on to you guys if you needed some cups for your toddlers this is lip balm in this little zipper bag and it's orange color and also i like the natural ones um michelle can she has a link on our in our hygiene items for the the chapstick because it's a really good um, natural kind that doesn't have that addicting quality that some of the lip balms do <coughs> excuse me here's his little underwear it has a soccer ball and other sports on it and a pair of socks um, that match the colors So almost done. We've got the pencil sharpener with a little whistle on a string. These are bamboo. I love them because they're fair trade. I'll have to tell Michelle the website where I got those and then she'll place them on the website. The link. This is a really cute, I just found this at the Gap Outlet yesterday. And it's, oh no, this is at Ross, yeah. And it's a Gymboree shirt. <clears throat> and I love the, it's really plain and cute and super soft. And it has these nice little, the ribbing with the orange, white, and blue on the sleeve. And it's just really, I don't know, I just think it's classy looking. So that's his shirt. And another one of those chunky cars because you've got to have two to play with to race and everything. And here's um, two more. I got a set of 10 of these colorful wooden puzzles for toddlers. Let's see, one, two, three, four. This has four pieces. One, two, three, four, five. And this has five pieces. And the boards are um, sanded so they don't have any rough edges. And I just love the colors and the fact that they um, don't just have a plain background, but they have a detailed background and they're very inexpensive for 10. And then I'm just splitting them into sets of five. Oh, five sets of two. That's a better way to say it. And then here's a toddler tote for him to put all of his little puzzle pieces in or whatever he wants to put in there. He can carry his things around. I love these toddler totes. Michelle's friend makes them. And then this is, boy, I'm getting a lot of things in here, aren't I? This is a washcloth, plain blue. I wanted to have two because they're just a little baby size one. And I just have the nail clippers in here and a big bar of ivory soap. The nail clippers, I thought his mom would grab right away and be able to use for him and the whole family. I love having nail clippers on hand. And this little coloring book is the one that Michelle makes. It's very sweet, has great pictures inside. Um, as the story goes, true story, boy set, uh, that was in an orphanage in a place that got, um, before he got his shoebox, they were in an orphanage, it was a war-torn country. And he said, um, the counselors made them draw images uh, of what they had seen, the horrors of war. And shortly after that, the shoeboxes came in because that was all that filled their mind and, and writing it down and drawing it just had um, maybe some kind of a therapeutic effect. But that was all that they thought about, missing limbs and dead people. And so they um, actually, when the shoeboxes came in, he talked about the difference that having a coloring book made because the a lot of the shoebox had coloring books 
And the boys then filled their minds with new memories, happy memories, as they looked at the pictures and they were just filled with joy in looking at the pictures um, because they were not the, the ugly scenes that they had in their mind. So it was able to help them therapeutically to have a coloring book. So I just love including coloring books now. I don't think of them as a waste of space. Here's an extra piece of chalk. I'm using these just to save on the plastic in my boxes. It's um, colorful envelopes that I found on Amazon, made out of paper. And last but not least, this lovey. And it, we, we made them, Michelle, I cut them out, Michelle sewed them for me. And um, it was a team effort to get these the size of a shoe box so they can just lay right down here. And of course this little satin ribbon is nice for them to stroke as they're falling asleep. So that's it. That's the end of this boy two to four toddler book a box. Let me know what you think is your favorite um, items in the box. I love hearing from you. Um, my boxes change all the time and I have new favorites every day. And so I um, love to hear from you what your favorites are. Or if you have a question about where to buy something. I'm really good about answering my comments. So thank you guys for watching. I pray that you're enjoying the shoebox packing season and that you have already started to get a lot of things for your shoebox. God bless you and bye for now.